whistleblower, Edward Snowden, has been nominated for the Nobel Peace Prize. In a letter to the prize committee, Swedish sociology professor Stefan Svalavors cites Snowden's, quote, heroic effort at great personal cost, saying he's helped to make the world a little bit safer and better. Svalavors also suggests giving the award to Snowden might make up for the, quote, disrepute incurred by the committee's ill-conceived decision to give President Obama the award in 2009. Snowden announced Friday he would seek temporary asylum in Russia until he could get to Latin America. Russian President Vladimir Putin has previously said Snowden must abandon work harmful to the U.S. in order to stay. On Monday, Putin accused the United States of trapping Snowden in Russia. He arrived in our country without an invitation. We didn't invite him, and he was not flying to us. He was flying in transit to other countries. But as soon as he got in the air, it became known, and our American partners actually blocked his further flight. They themselves scared other countries. Guardian columnist Glenn Greenwald, who revealed Snowden's leaks, is hitting back at a Reuters article he says is aimed at distracting attention from revelations about the NSA's massive secret spying at home and abroad. The article quotes Greenwald in an interview with the Argentinian daily La Nación, saying, quote, Snowden has enough information to cause more harm to the U.S. government in a single minute than any other person has ever had, and that, quote, the U.S. government should be on its knees every day begging that nothing happen to Snowden because if something does happen to him, all the information will be revealed and it could be its worst nightmare, unquote. In a piece for The Guardian, Glenn Greenwald says the quotes were taken out of context and misconstrued as threats. Greenwald wrote, quote, My point in this interview was clear. Had Snowden wanted to harm the U.S. government, he easily could have, but hasn't. That demonstrates how irrational is the claim that his intent is to harm the U.S., Greenwald wrote. He went on, quote, I'm reporting what documents he says he has and what precautions he says he's taken to protect himself from what he perceives to be the threat to his well-being. That's not a threat. Those are facts, said Glenn Greenwald.